Today we're at 3328 Linecrest Road here in Rex, Georgia. Doing a QC inspection for a recent renovation. Unfortunately, upon entry I found the home insecure. You can see these tire tracks that go around to the back. I thought for sure that we would find all appliances gone and the inside destroyed, but that is not the case. Fortunately, some people just came in, probably just kids hanging out, something like that. Here's their point of entry. They basically kick the door in. Correction, they didn't kick the door in, my bad. They kicked the window in. The door was also left wide open in the back, as was the barred screen door. You can see all these nice bars along the back windows. There are a total of 11 windows. Of the four that did not have bars, that was one of the two that actually opened up and down. And there's some markings. I'm not sure what happened there, but that was left wide open uh, when I arrived. I did contact Bravo immediately, spoke with property manager uh, Michael Brock and they have authorities out on the way I will be going after my concealed weapons permit uh, next weekend I promise and here's where the perps evidently drove off you can see tire tracks leading out to the driveway so let's talk about the house fortunately the house other than the window damage is in good shape Brand new carpet. A little bit of residue here. I think that's actually cigar residue. Because when I came over here to the front uh, bedroom window, I did notice that there is a wrapper here. Okay, let's take a look at the home. Try not to get too distracted. bathroom needs to be cleaned. This is where some hairstyling was going on. No visible signs of any kind of water damage on the home. Again, the house really looks good appears to be brand new carpet. If it's not, it's real close. I do know that the previous tenant ran for her life as three times there was break-ins attempted while she was home. So this may not have been brand new carpet. It might have been for the tenant previously. Brand new black appliances. All matching. One minor issue. The brand new stove top does not work. I did look for garage door openers on the counter. As you can see, we don't have those, but we do have leftovers from the contractors from some of the work. We'd ask that that be cleaned up along with the cigar remains and the leftovers in the bathroom. Tray ceilings here in the uh, master. This is the point of entry for our perpetrators. Going to need to replace some blinds there. And one window. Could have been a lot worse. That jacuzzi tub looks awful inviting. Uh, surprised there's not more damage in there. But at any rate, home looks good. With the exception of those couple areas, we do have a contractor on the way out to secure the home. Um, the authorities are supposed to be on the way just to basically document what happened here. Hopefully we can find out who did this. Put an end to it. We do have carbon monoxide sensors. 
right here in the hallway. Occasionally I'm hearing a chirping uh, smoke detector, so that means we had one smoke detector that needed a new battery, but it doesn't do it all the time. The garage is in great shape. Recently painted, they just sealed the floors. Air conditioning's working great. Mechanically and structurally, the home is outstanding. Just a few issues to correct upon the uh, break-in and also some of the leftovers left by the contractors there. Uh, and we are good to go. That concludes our inspection.